Martin Sherlock is 21. In those few years, he has already lived a lifetime. He's walked the streets, been in jail, unfairly according to himself, married and had a family. He and his wife, Rose, married at 17. They already have two children, one died. Now another baby girl has arrived. Rose Sherlock and her baby have a shaky future. She and her two-year-old son, Martin, have already been evicted from number 35, Lord House, off Sean McDermott Street, when her husband was in prison. The family have been squatting there for two years. The Sherlocks say they will not pay a rent until they're given a right to the flat or any flat. The Sherlocks and their relations, and thousands like them, have been born on the wrong side of the tracks. They don't seem to have much chance of switching now. I went over to the corporation and I asked them about a house. They told me I must have a child before I get a house. So the first child came along and there was still no, no question of getting a house. I was told then I must have two. So I, I couldn't wait that long time. You know, for, on, on, you know, in the guys next year being born, so I had to, um, to break into a place. So what you done? I was in there for uh, about nine months and everything was quite gone okay for me. Until the corporation, the set man out of the corporation came over to me and he asked me, if I leave without any trouble, I will get a place in a short time. So which I left. And uh, I waited for six months, which I was back walking out the streets again. I was living with my brother one day. I married him the next day, and that's the way it kept going. Me. Was every, everything then was gone against me. I found this place out, and then I broke into this. Mr. Sherlock, you've just had this baby girl only about an hour or so ago. Yeah. Where are you going to go when you leave uh, this hospital? Well, uh, really, I don't know, because, I mean, I still have the flat that I am in there at the moment, you know. And then probably when I go out, the flat could be gone. Someone else could be living in there. You have no right to be living in it, of course. No. I am only a squatter. So anybody can walk in? Anyone can go into us. What would you do if there was somebody in it when you walk out of here? What could I do? It's not really I could do. What about your relations? Well, there's no one there I can really go to. You know, when the... Well, it's true, they say when you might, everyone forgets you, you know. Just not want us. That's that. You've chilled it like that.